Hello, my berries. It's me, Darkberry32. <sighs> what a week. No, last week was the week. And this was something else, too. It's Saturday, guys, and um, I'm in some kind of mode. Um, on my last vlog, you guys know I was sick. My mom was in the hospital. It was Jordan's birthday. My sister gave birth, and then my best friend lost her mama. And so the wake was um, last night, and I attended. And for some of you guys that don't know me, me and Wake's funerals, we just don't get along. It's not like, you know, I know most people are like, oh, man, well, who does like a Wake? Who does like a funeral? Y'all, it's a totally different animal Animal with, with me and Kayla, as a matter of fact. Kayla didn't even go, and I didn't force her to go because um, it's something that freaks us out really, really bad. And... Um, but I had to go last night. I don't normally volunteer to go to those types of things. But I had to go last night because of my best friend. I had to. I'm not going today. I am not going to the funeral. And she totally understands. We've been friends for years. And y'all, I didn't have to sleep any last night. And I know it's telling all over my face, all in my voice. It was the hardest thing to fall asleep last night. And, um,. As soon as I would fall asleep, my stomach would get all nervous and twitchy and jumpy, and then I'd wake right up. So, if any of you guys are like that out there, let me know. And if you've overcome it, <laughs> let me know how you've done that, too. Um, I don't know. Some people say I, I need to go to more. And that would um, get me through it. And, but you got to be really, really brave to do that, to face that fear. But y'all felt like I faced it last night, but I only face it when I think I absolutely need to. And I, and that's being there for people. So, anyway. Today, we're actually going to go and see some girls that Kayla used to dance with in um, dance competition. I know for some of you that followed us for a long time, Kayla used to be all made up and everything. And Did you get the thingy? What thingy? The trunk. The what? The trunk. It hasn't touched it. Shut up. <laughs> she scared me. Um, yeah, like when she was... In competition and dance, and we would make sure we have all of our Every costumes. Time, you got stick. And, yeah, one time she had a prop of a stick, and and then we uh, had the spirit stick thing. Yeah, and then we just oh god, it was always nerve wracking because it's like, what am I gonna forget? What am I gonna forget? So anyway, um, we're gonna go see them perform today. Competition, just a few of them. Uh, we're not gonna stay all day, most of the day, but we're not gonna stay all day. And um, yeah. So it should be fun. And we're not going to be able to record. Um, not, um, supposed to record when you're in these things. Because it's like you can take some of these dance. You know, people copy and stuff. So you're not supposed to do that kind of stuff. But, you know, it should be a fun field day. And then maybe later on today, um, I want to take the family to a place to eat um, in, in uh, another part of the town. Um, it's a place called Sharky's. And it's supposed to be really like relaxed and stuff and I think that's what I need um, I'm also I volunteered to cook my best friend dinner tomorrow after church so I need to come up with a meal plan and go to the store and all that good stuff oh yeah I just got I just got chock full weekend but I just I wanted to do something for her I had already went and visit her last Friday right before I got really really sick um, you want to stop and get something yeah. And, um, so anyway, I, I stopped and I had got her some food and drinks and treats and all that kind of stuff for her and her daughter. And, and then I got really, really sick last weekend, so we're going to grab some breakfast real fast for Kayla. I hope we don't miss anybody, Kayla, by doing this. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Didn't see you there. <laughs> Guess where we are, guys. The, 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 the mall. The mall. We are at the mall once again. We are actually looking for yeah. banquet because every time I, I've been filming here lately, like going to the mall a lot. Um. Anyway, Kayla's supposed to be going to some banquets or something, and we're trying to 
get an idea of what kind of dress she's gonna need or want. Or... So she doesn't want to go too dressy, but she doesn't want to go too plain. Dang. Yeah. And she's, you know how girls are. I want to know what everybody else is wearing. Just want to get an idea. Just like get an idea. <laughs> so anyway, I guess she'll start asking her friends, "What are you wearing? What are you wearing?" And but for now, we're just kind of out and about. We got some time to burn. We went and seen the girls dance. Watch that go. We went to see those girls dance, and uh, they did really well. And um, we're gonna go back because I got more dances to do. And so, but for now, we're out shopping. Mm. Mm. Ooh, it feels warm. Thank God, somebody's got sense to make it warm in the stores. You know, they got they got dresses in here. You want to look in here? Hey. Upstairs. So we're at Dillard. Oh, I got right up. Mm -hmm. See, like right up there. Yeah. Right up there. Mm -hmm. Right there. So we're gonna see what we can find for Miss Kayla. And I'm not going to be going to look at she is. Right? Ooh, I love that yellow blouse. I love that dress. <laughs> You're cool? I don't shop at dealers enough. Is it at one more? Is it at one more? But I thought the formal ones, like... Hmm. Oh, yeah, they're up, I think they're up here. Oh, I like that yellow. I just love the color. I love this. Buy, buy me that dress. See how she just walked on? I need a dress. Please. Please, Kayla. I want the dress, Kayla. They got some cute spring yeah, stuff. Yeah, we can get some spring weather. What? Remember when um, we were shopping for the fifth grade math banquet? Mm -hmm. I wanted that purple dress. And all the two said, no. <laughs> I wanted that dress. Yeah. Okay, I think we're in the right area. That's cute. Springy. Let's look at it. Let's get a close up of this dress. Not poofy enough. Not poofy enough, she says. All right, let's just see. I'm not gonna shop. I'm gonna let her shop. Oh boy. <laughs> I already know where you're going. You could always put something black under it and put a belt to connect it all. That's what I'm saying. I don't like the top. Oh, you don't like the top? God, that's a great price. I'm like, can we just take this off? And not buy this for the I mean, we can buy it, buy it for the skirt, and then you can get something else to put on top. Mm -hmm. I knew you were gonna go for that. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, it's, it's perfect. still not poofy. It's perfect. <laughs> Kayla wants to be back in the 50s. We should buy something for that Lippy London. Hmm? That, uh, that London website. For your dress? Yeah. I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm trying to fight it, but I'm really hungry. Ooh, Kayla, I bet this would be so pretty on you. This right here. This one. Ooh, I'm looking wild. Why didn't tell me I was looking wild? Why are you doing this looking kind of old? Look what I'm wearing down, y'all. This is my outfit of the day. Tennis shoes, jeans, and hoodie sweatshirt. That's it. She's not shopping. She's picking at her nails. It was annoying me. I kept getting caught on stuff. You want to try on a dress? I don't like it, though. Okay, you don't want to try on nothing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
I love that. Can you try that on for me? They got pretty good prices in here to say this is dealers. Oh, and the back is out. Look at that. This is a nine. You think you can get your waist in there? <laughs> that's a nine. That's a five. This is a five. Three. Okay. Seven. Thirteen. <laughs> and it jumps. Probably the nine. You gonna try it on? I'm doing this for you. She's doing it for me. Okay, where's the dressing room? Is that one over there? In the corner? Oh, yeah. They got really cute stuff. I need to come. I, I, I need to stop sleeping on Dillard's. Okay, I gotta turn this off. <laughs> turn. You're silly. That's silly goose. Hi, Kayla. We're trying a new place called. Trying to decide what he wants. Kayla knows what she wants. I don't know what I want. It's a cool looking place. Let's see how it goes. Kayla getting the fish and chips. Babe, hey, what are you debating about? Thank you. Just in time. Right? Uh huh. Right? Yeah. <laughs> the, the Bikini Beach. It's really good. I needed that. Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? No. We're going to get a closer look at So these are shark, shark bites. So, babe. Take one and tell me what it tastes like. Yeah, they look good. So do you? Oh, so you do need a plate. <laughs> So I got my stuffed shrimp. Taylor got a fish and chips. Yeah. And I've got his cob salad with shrimp. Bon appetito, y'all. Bon appetito. Sorry. Bon appetito. Bon appetito. Bon appetito. Bon appetito. <laughs>
saints. Amen. Amen. You may be seated in the presence of the Lord. I'm glad to be here. Grateful for Pastor. Amen. But I've uh, had a good time. I preached last night and I uh, preached this morning and I'm here for the second service. How many are glad to be in the house of the Lord? I want to, uh, just before we go into the Word of God, two things I want to invite you to the pastor, the leadership conference that we're having. I'm, I'm big on leadership. I think that leadership is a very important thing. I think there's a deficit of leadership in our nation, in our families, in our communities. We need great leaders. And, and even in the church, we need great leaders. There's a difference between great preaching and great leadership. Some men are blessed to have both. Some, some are one or the other, and they have to hire the other one. Some don't have it either. <laughs> and, and there's nothing worse. I tell people in a marriage, it's a terrible thing. The Bible says a woman that helped me to her husband. It, it's hard to help somebody who's not doing anything. You, you, you can't help anybody who's not going anywhere. If, if you're going to be a leader, you got to move. Amen? <laughs> not, nothing like following somebody who's parked. Peter, James, and John have been chosen. They have been selected. They have been picked out. They have a track record with Jesus. They have a track record with it. They have been through some things. They have a track record with Jesus. I was counseling somebody the other day. They wanted me to perform a wedding. I said, I'd be glad to perform the wedding. I said, how long have you known this gentleman? They said, about a month. I said, where did you meet him? They said, on the internet. I said, how old is he? They told me how old he was. I said, have you been married before? They said, three times. I said, wait. Just, just, just. I don't have to have to get to prophecy to say that maybe you ought to get to know this a little bit better. Why do people try to take people into intimate places who have not earned the right to go up with them? You have to earn the right to go with me. You don't just flash around and walk into me. There, there's certain things, if you value yourself, if you treasure yourself, if you treasure your journey and your process, you don't just pick up just anybody and take them with you into your inner sanctum. Let all the careful people clap in here. but you're just careful. I know they say you think you're so much, but you're just careful. Some people misunderstand it, but you have been through too much to make the same mistakes over and over and over again. I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy. There you go. Jesus takes Peter, James, and John.